based on a dog napping mystery in Montgomery County. An expensive puppy stolen from a pet store is found safe. CBS3 reporter Mary Stoker-Smith live now in Northtown with the details. Mary? It is a happy ending, Angela. Garcia, the Yorkie worth $1,300, was taken from the pet store on Saturday. Today, he was returned to the pet store owner here at the Montgomery County Courthouse, and the owner will now take the Yorkie home. This is Garcia, the four-month-old Yorkshire Terrier that was stolen from Tom's Pet Outlet in Lower Providence on Saturday. Today, he was returned to Tom Reed, the owner of the pet store, by Montgomery County DA Bruce Castor. You usually see me when I'm announcing somebody's dead and somebody's going to jail, uh, so this is quite a, quite a different take. This is surveillance video from the pet store. You can see a woman in a red and white jacket standing in front of the cage, opening the door and removing the puppy, putting it in her jacket, and walking out the front door. The plan seemed to go off without a hitch until the surveillance video turned up on television. The person who stole the dog uh, realizes the enormous publicity that went along with it and, and is scared to death that, that we're going to come kick the door in and take him out of bed at 5 o'clock in the morning. Yesterday, attorney Dennis Gaglia got a call from a friend of the dog napper saying she felt remorse and wanted to return the pup. Today, Gaglia met with the friend who handed Garcia over unharmed. They have not been able to identify the woman who stole the dog, but owner Tom Reed says at this point he doesn't want to press charges. He's right just happy the Yorkie wasn't hurt. Just a little common cold could be fatal to a dog that size. So just to get the dog back was the most important thing. And while the owner does not want to press charges, Castor says his office will continue to investigate, and if they catch the thief, she faces charges of retail theft. The Yorkie, by the way, is doing just fine. Reporting in Norristown, Montgomery County, Mary Stoker-Smith, CBS3 Eyewitness News.